Hey everybody, welcome back or welcome to Something Old, Something New Car Rips. I'm Lance and today's Wednesday, so we're doing our weekly wrap-up. And uh, didn't really get much <coughs> excuse me, in personal rips or online or anything like that, but I'll show you what I got. for. So we went through our third stack of uh, the repacked wax. Got a lot of Hall of Famers in there. It's really come McCovey 73 is pretty sweet looking. Dave Winfield's, King Griffey Jr. This Frank Thomas is cool. Tom Seaver, 85 Tops Design. This Nolan Ryan from 76. Pretty nice. The corner's all dinged up, but that's pretty cool. And then we actually did pull an autograph out of there. That's where we got one more stack left. We'll be opening in that this week. And then we had the Fat Pack Friday. Elite had this Justin Jefferson pink. And the 2020 Donners had this Press Proof Blue Tua, who just got named starting quarterback for the Miami Dolphins after they get them back from their bye week. And then Sunday was a box of Prestige 2020 Blaster. Not really anything big in there. This Heroes car was cool. But I believe he's injured as well. <clears throat> Most hurt. And then we had the Monday Mix, or Miss, really, because I didn't really get it. These are actually the guaranteed hits, these top cards here. Bat of Benini, Benji Molina and this Pedro Martinez. These three cards were actually packaged separately. And then out of the packs, the best cards I get was this 3,000 hit uh, Cal Ripken and a couple of uh, 15 and under or uh, Stars and Stripes, Corey Seager and Royce Lewis. So really not very good Monday. And then Tuesday's pack was pretty good. Just one pack of T206. And I pulled both the Nico Horner and the Kyle Lewis rookie. And the Nico Horner's got the Sovereign back. So that was pretty good. Personal rips, me and my daughter are working through a pack of 2020 Tops Minor Leagues Heritage. Or box, not a pack. And we're looking for hops, car hops cars because that's our local Hillsboro Hops, are our local, uh, our only, cl our closest major league team, Meyer League, single A. Gunnar Henderson, he's a really young guy. Royce Lewis, and then our autographs. My daughter pulled both of them. We got two of them. We got uh, Keona Cavaco and Jaron Duran. And then I got, she actually pulled the Wander Franco also. So my daughter was doing pretty well. Then I got a blaster box of Chronicles, and then I got Green, Cunha Jr., a couple of Pete Alonzo's for the PC. This Crusade is a really sweet looking card. Really added this box so that my unparalleled were really, really well. I'll show you those in a second. Here's Brendan McKay's, and then here's our unparalleled. These are only in the blaster boxes. So I got the Aaron Judge regular, I got the Aaron Judge Astral. Well, that was cool. Oh, Jordan Alvarez, Ricky Green. But then I got a Bo Bichette and a Luis Robert. So those were my unparallels. That was, uh, first I was, didn't want to get the unparallels because I like, oh, I want some more of the, cause I didn't get any of the uh, Titan ones. And those are the ones I really like, but uh, that worked out really well for me. And actually pretty much those all pretty much, definitely Bo Bichette. Luis Robert, this green yard on Alvarez is good. I'm going to go ahead and put this astral Aaron Judge up there as well. Really like the looks of that uh, Crusades. And then Papa Jays, I was in the break for, had 2017 and 2020 Chronicles. And I got this Zach Galen rookie card, numbered out of 50. I, I had the Diamondbacks and the Phillies, but it worked out okay because the Phillies 17 was right, Reese Hoskins. So I got this Reese Hoskins numbered out of 149, rookie 37, and this other Reese Hoskins contenders optics, rookie. A couple other cards as well. And he threw in a pack of 1990 Donruss. And then this was an eBay pickup, 1970 Tops, Luis Aparicio. Pretty good shape. Let me play. Went back to the White Sox. I really like the looks of this card. So I just go ahead and start picking up some more of this vintage stuff now that I'm almost through my repack wax box. And then from the LCS this week, picked up this Crazy Legs e. Elroy Hirsch, 1957. Not too bad. The corner's a little dinged up there. There's the back. Centering's not horrible. Left to right's not good though. 
This Nelly Fox. I thought that was a pretty cool card. Big old chaw in there from 61 tops. Another Luis Aparicio. Thought that was a really sweet card. There's the back of that guy. Put that up there. And then I just got a couple of uh, New York Mets cards. And it's Tom Seaver, 71 NL strikeout leaders. Got Fergie Jenkins on there and an Expos, car, Expos player as well. So I thought that was just a sweet looking card. So back of that guy and the back of the Mets card. So there you go. There's my what I figure is my top five for the week. Let me know if you agree. Like I said, that blaster of the Chronicles ended up being really well with the Unparalleled. Uh, as always, thanks for watching. I hope everyone had a great week and is having a great week. And you get through the rest of the week to your weekend. I hope everyone's watching the World Series. Getting Dodgers are up one nothing After last night's game, we've got a game today as well. As always, thanks for watching. Take care, everyone, and good luck to you.